Hello, my beautiful Aries. Welcome to one of our special readings. And since this weekend, we have a full moon and it's a partial lunar eclipse as well. Let's see what's hidden from you and what's coming to the surface. Messages for all of you, as you always know, these are very special energies that's coming in through. My highly resonate with you, Aries, or my do not. Take it accordingly. Let's see, loves. What's hitting from you? What's coming to the surface? Nine of Swords underneath. Four of Wands. Queen of Swords, Knight of Wands, and Seven of Swords, Queen of Pentacles. Wow. Five of Swords, Seven of Swords are my least favorite cards. And look at here, five, seven, nine. It's quite an energy here. But what I'm hearing here, that something doesn't work the way it's supposed to, and for some of you, what's coming forward, there is a conversation here with someone. And based on that conversation, you will know most likely what to do next or what's your next steps. For example, if you definitely want to build a life with someone and you know, for quite a while you were thinking like what I'm doing here, what they are doing here, what are we doing here? You are going to see or you're going to make a final decision. Yes, we do have a lot of swords. Swords speaks about thoughts, but also swords are fast energy. Whatever here is going to happen, it's going to happen very fast, quick. And there's something here is like, I'm not going to wait forever. Or someone here is just out of patience. If you've been patient for quite a while, you are not going to be anymore. For some of you, someone's actions come to the surface. Let's see what's more here. Because someone here does one thing, says one thing, does another. Yeah, look at here, this tower. Five of Cups. Judgment. And the Tower and the Judgment. Both cards are about awakening energy. And Eight of Swords. For many of you, there are certain things here that you you couldn't see. Definitely, you are going to see it. However, what's hidden from you, definitely it's someone's actions or how they do. Because someone here doesn't feel like they are honest to you. For some of you, there's some truth coming in. And some of you, Aries, may found out that why you cannot be with someone, you know, together or why this person feels kind of weird lately. That might be a third party involved. So be aware of that. For some of you, you might not see that. And for others of you, the person you are dealing, they might deal with someone, someone else. Okay. The Tower moment here, Ace of Cups, the Five of Cups, Four of Swords, and the Eight of Swords, Knight of Pentacles. For others of you, Aries, you, you might find out that the person, yes, who you are with, they might be involved with others. It's kind of they, they could come to your house all the time. 
It's not like you're going to them or you're living together. And for some of you, you might, you might have someone new coming in, but might not be necessary into that person. So many, many of you, you, you're about to experience a very fast forward energy in which you will find a lot of things that you probably didn't find for quite a while. For others of you, I'm hearing the next or within one month or two, no longer than that. You, you might found yourself in a whole different energy or situation. If now you are with someone and struggle or certain things here not going really wow, it's kind of like in in two months you, you could date someone else or even move in with someone else. Sounds crazy, but it's not that crazy. Because for some of you, you could have two people around, but one of them... You not see them as a uh, as a lover, or you see them more as a friend. But that person love you. So what's hidden for you? For some of you, may may have someone confess to you their love. I don't feel here. You see that. But once they do, now you will see. It's kind of think about it. If you are with someone here, here and there, back and forth, back and forth. Think about what to do. Because there is this person. Let's see. The energy here for this person who you who you not really consider as the one or you might be a friend with them. Let's see. High priestess. Yeah, this person deep down they absolutely love you. But also this person might be might be very strong connected with you on a spiritual level. Like they do understand you just looking at you. They see through you. Okay. This person also wants to be with you for quite a while. It's kind of like even before you've been with this person you are. Yes. They may also be very much like, I don't know what I I found or how I kind of tell. I feel like this person were wanting to tell you about their feelings for quite a while. But for some reason, they could not. They, they look like, no, that's not quite. They are, have other people or they've been with other people, things like that. They... They could show themselves in some kind of way, but now they they can't any longer. They can't. And let's see here also the the person who you you might let go here for whatever reason. The the yin and out energy here. Let's see. Page of Pentacles. The Empress. Well, this person, it's very, okay, okay, this person might, might not be happy where they are, and they know eventually they will be let out. They could be, for some of you, this person could be married, for others of you, this person is comfortable in their marriage based on the finances. Might not be comfortable with who they are. Because I don't feel them uh, emotionally fulfilled. That's why the emotional fulfillment you are giving them. But yes, they are a pretty materialistic person. Also, they could have certain... Um, Addictions over there, drinking, you know, other addictions, they are, they are over there. But it's more likely they do that because 
you know, to kind of like escape from a situation. How about you, loves? Eight of Pentacles. Hierophant. For some of you, you definitely want to work on a connection that is for the long term. But not quite sure. It's just kind of like you... If something here doesn't go into the long term, you prefer to stay alone. Or if something here is not serious, then you prefer to stay alone. So I see you kind of at the crossroads. But Spirit says, you are going to start moving forward, loves. You do. You are on the right path. Whatever here you do, whatever here you're working on, you are going to move. And also here, speaking of the nine we have the nine of wands nine of pentacles nine of cups and nine of swords nine speaks about endings and with the tower here there is a, some kind of ending is going to happen suddenly because tower also speaks about sudden and then there's something else for those of you who are dealing here with someone who is in and out most likely spirit says you will let them go or something here is going to happen that you suddenly will find yourself into something new as i said prior like if certain things here didn't, didn't work in a very short time you might even start living with someone okay what the spirit advice is there for you knight of cups there's an offer on the horizon King of Cups. Whoever here offers a little will offer more. But this person definitely love you, and they are. I'm hearing they are. They are like a melon. They are very mellow. What I mean through that, look at here. Two cards: the the Star and the Two of Pentacles. You will not quite sure if you want them. But definitely this person finds you very attractive. They do really want it, you. But they don't know if you want them. But also this person wants to be with you for the long run. Okay. There is also something here about take your time. Don't rush. The only knight missing here is knight of swords. For some of you Aries, the knight of swords is your knight does not mean that you are an air sign, but I feel here you are very much in a logical position. You are not as much emotional or into your emotions. You, you more likely do what you think is right for you, not what you feel is right for you. So some of you may have a lot of air in the chart, but I see you very much in the air energy. Again, don't rush. But now, the offer that is given, or it's on the table, it's for the long run. And yeah, that's what's hidden from you, loves. Blessings. Thank you for watching. And definitely here, manifest big for this full moon. Namaste.